Hey guys, so I thought I would narrate this vlog for you just because it's a little choppy. Um, so the whole reason that we were in Siesta Key in Florida was because my brother was preparing to propose to his girlfriend. They have been together for like five years or so and he wanted to propose to her in Florida. Um, his girlfriend's grandparents have a condo that they're like snowbirds so in the winter when it's cold in Ohio they come to Florida to get out of the cold and so they have a house there and so um, my brother's girlfriend and her family always go to Florida after Christmas every year to go visit them and my brother usually goes with them so he wanted to propose to that to her on the beach in Florida super pretty and my mom had a great idea that why don't all of us come down and surprise her um, and celebrate with them. So we all bought plane tickets, we got condos, and uh, we told my brother about it, he was super excited about it, and we all went to Florida. So my brother proposed to his girlfriend, she of course said yes, it was on the beach, super pretty. Um, we all got like group shots um, afterwards and we got a cute little family shot, so I'll input some pictures of that here. to this super nice restaurant I don't remember the name of it um, but it was really cool they had uh, reserved a place for us and it was like we were out like on the side of the restaurant out by like they had a, like a, a deck and you could like overlooking the water it was super pretty of course it was warm because it was Florida and they had like twinkling lights above us and um, we got a cake that said like congratulations they had like a fancy menu that had like selections it was super expensive meal but that was really fun and then after all of that after we put gray down and everything we then went out to um go and celebrate just like the older kids so everybody that was 21 and up went out so we went to uh, a bar and then after that we went to a karaoke bar and i i don't know if we knew that it was going to be karaoke bar I don't usually go to karaoke bars, but wow, that was so fun. There were a good amount of people there, and um, at one point, us girls all sang a song. We sang, I want to dance with somebody. Then we got all the boys to go up and sing, and we made them sing Bohemian Rhapsody, and it was just super fun. Um, people kept going up and singing good songs, um, Piano Man, and sweet caroline and just a bunch of fun songs um we all got a little tipsy not gonna lie we were drinking celebrating um but it was super super fun um it was a great time we all had so much fun together we stayed out pretty late into the night so it was a really good time so i got some video of course i had to take the audio out because i don't want to like do copyright infringement so i'm just gonna put some youtube music in there
um, all of that, we then took a shuttle uh, to get back to our condos because we were a little bit far away from where our condos were. And thankfully on the island, they have this free shuttle that drives up and down the main street where we were. And if you find it and flag it down, they'll give you rides to wherever you want to go. I think they assume that you'll tip them, um, but yeah, it's free. So we were able to flag them down and we got a free ride. And they had it was cool. They had like disco lights going on. We were blasting music. It was great. So I got a, a video of that. So y'all made it home and it was a great night. The next day was New Year's Eve. And a tradition in my family is that we would always get ch uh, Chinese food on New Year's Eve. Uh, my family, we didn't get Chinese very often, but one uh, for sure we always knew we would get it on New Year's Eve. So we, um, of course, where we were on the island, if you know Siesta Key, we were like on the very like edge of the island. There was like no food close to us, so we always had to um, door dash a food to us. So uh, we door dashed Chinese food, and that was super fun. And we stuffed ourselves with Chinese food. My parents had gone out to go meet their friends on a different part of Florida, so they were gone. And then us older kids, um, once it got closer to midnight, we actually went out and there was like a little like outdoor bar with like a white tent above it. And they had the TVs on and they were playing like the countdown in New York and all that. So we went and uh, we went and watched the ball drop and it was really fun. Uh, so I got a picture of that. We, you know, Anthony and I kissed at midnight, and it was great. So it was super fun. Happy New Year's Eve! We're having Woo! Chinese food. Chinese food. Chinese food. Oh, oh, oh. Alright, bless at least both open. Happy 2020. Happy 2020. Happy 2020. Happy 2020. Of the vlog I just have random clips of us like in the ocean or in the pool um, but it was a great vacation I'm super glad we went it was so nice to get out of the cold for just a couple days um, and yeah we had a really good time Gray had an awesome time he loves being around all of his aunts and uncles and it worked out really well that everybody could go and be there. So I'm super excited for my brother and his now fiance. Uh, they're starting wedding planning and hopefully we'll have a date soon to know when they're gonna have their wedding. So bring on another wedding. But yeah, so I think that's all for this vlog. Give it a thumbs up, subscribe, cause lots more videos coming. And I hope you enjoy the last couple of clips uh, that I have. Bye guys. Oh! <laughs>
Ha, ha, ha.